By my head, here comes a Capulet. By my heel, I care not. Follow me close, for I will speak to them. Gentlemen, good den. A word with one of you? Bird with one of us. Come with something and make it a word and a blow. You shall find me apt enough to that, sir, and you will give me occasion. Can you not take some occasion without giving? Mercutio, thou consortest with Romeo. What dost thou make us? Minstrels. And thou make minstrels of us. Look to hear nothing but discord. Here's my fiddlestick. Here's that shall make you dance. Zounds consort. We talk here in the public haunt of men. Either withdraw to some private place and reason coldly with your grievances, or else depart, hear all eyes gaze on us. Remain to look, and let them gaze. I will not budge, for no man's pleasure I. Well, peace be with you, sir. Here comes my man. And I'll be hanged, sir, if you wear your livery. Mary, go before the field, he'll be your follower. Your worship, in that sense, may call him man. Romeo, the hate I bear thee can afford no better term than this. Thou art a villain. Tybalt, the reason that I have to love thee doth much excuse the appertaining range. To such a greedy villain I am none. Therefore farewell, I see thou know'st me not. Boy, this shall not excuse the injuries thou hast done me. Therefore turn and draw. I do protest, I never injured thee, but love thee better than my thou canst devise. Till thou shalt know the reason of my love, and so good Capulet, which name I tender as clearly as my own, be satisfied. Oh, calm, this honorable, vile submission, Alstacato carries it away. Tybalt, you rat catcher, will you walk? What wouldst thou have with me? Good king of cats, nothing but one of your nine lives. That I mean to make bold withal. And as you shall use me hereafter, dry beat the rest of the eight. Will you pluck your sword out of the picture by the ears? Make haste, lest mine be about your ears, ere it be out. I am for you. Gentle Mercutio, put thy rapier up. Come, sir, your Pisano. Drop and Bolio, beat down their weapons. Gentlemen, for shame, forbear this outrage. Tybalt Mercutio, the prince expressly hath forbidden bandying in Verona streets. Hold Tybalt, good Mercutio. Temper, softened bound of steel. 
Quote Romeo, Romeo, pray Mercutio's death. That gallant spirit hath inspired in the clouds, which to a timely here did scorn the earth. This day is like fate, a more haste on the head. This but begins the love, others must die. Here comes that furious tibble back again. Alive in triumph, and Mercutio slain, away to heaven, respective lenity, and fire-eyed fury be my conduct now. Now, Tybalt, take the villain back again, that that late thou gavest me, for Mercutio's soul is but a little way above our heads, staying for thine to keep him company. Either thou or I, or both, must go with him. Thou wretched boy that didst consort him here, shall with him hence. Romeo, away, be gone, the citizens are up and Tybalt slain. Stand not amazed, the prince will doom thee death. If thou art taken, hence, be gone away. Boy, fortune's fool. Why dost thou say? Which way ran he that killed Mercutio? Tybalt, that murder. Which way ran he? There lies that Tybalt. Oh, sir, come with me. I charge thee in the prince's name away. Where are the vile beginners of this fray? Noble prince, I can discover all. The unlucky manage of this fatal brawl. There lies the man slain by young Romeo that slew thy kinsman. Brave Mercutio. Ah! <laughs> Tiblet, my cousin! Oh, my brother's child, oh, prince, oh, cousin, husband, oh, the blood is spilt. Oh, my dear kinsman, prince, as thou art true. For blood of ours shed blood of Montague, oh, cousin, cousin. Benvolio, who began this bloody fray? Tybalt, here slain, who Romeo's hand did slay. Romeo, that spoke him fair, made, bade him bethink how nice the quarrel was, and urge withdrawal. Your high displeasure, all this uttered with gentle breath, calm look, these humbly bowed, could not take truce with the unruly spleen of Tybalt, deaf to peace. But he that tilts with piercing steel that bold Mercutio's breast, who all is hot, turns deadly point to point, and, with a martial scorn, one hand beats cold death aside, and with the other sends it back to Tybalt, whose dexterity retorts it. Romeo, he cries aloud, hold friends, friends part, and swifter than his tongue, his agile arm beats down their fatal points, and twists them with rushes, underneath whose arm an envious thrust from Tybalt hit the life of stout Mercutio, and then Tybalt fled, but by and by comes back to Romeo, who had but newly entertained revenge. And two they go like lightning, for ere I, I could draw to part them, it was stout Tybalt slain. And as he fell, Romeo, Romeo did turn and fly. And this is the truth, or let Benvolio die. He is a kinsman to the Montague. Affection makes him false. He speaks not true. Some twenty of them fought in this black strife. And those twenty could but kill one like I beg for justice, which the prince must give Romeo still to let Romeo must not live. He slew him, he slew Mercutio, who now the price of his dear blood doth owe. Not Romeo, prince, he was Mercutio's friend. The fall concludes with what the law should end, the life of Tybalt. And for that offense, immediately we do exile him hence. I have an interest in your hate's proceedings. My blood for your rude brawl doth lie a-bleeding, but I'll immerse you with so strong a fine that you shall all repent the loss of mine. I will be deaf to pleading and excuses, nor tears nor prayer shall purchase out abuses. Therefore, and use none, let Romeo hence in haste, else when he's found, that hour is his last. Bear hence this body, and attend our will, mercy but murders, pardoning those that kill. Are we ready? <laughs> Okay, we should film it in here. For you. <laughs> I don't have my gun. <laughs> okay. Peach, go, villain! Which way ran he that killed Mercutio? Tybalt, that murder. Which way ran he? There lies that Tybalt. Okay. But dominant. you're not like, shooting right now, so just bring it up and go like, I am flinching or whatever. <laughs> okay. Are you filming? 
Yeah. Yeah.